So guys, in today's code with PK video, I am telling you about what are what are brain.js. If you don't know what are brain.js, so uh, in today's video, whole thing I will be cover about that in tensor flow. Okay, so get it, get ready for that and let move the computer screen and let's do a coding with laughing. So guys, in today's uh, machine learning video, I am telling you about the brain.js. If you don't know what a brain.js in today's video, your whole concept will be clear about that. Brain.js is a JavaScript library that makes it easy to understand neural networks because it hides the complexity of the mathematics. Building a neural network. If you are building a neural network with brain.js, so you wrote like that. Here you can see it. This one code has been written. If you copy it like that and when you go here and if you write here replit click on the replit and open the replit then what you can do go down first of all open your node.js file and the Python file also then what you can do here you can remove that and then paste it and then run it then when you run it copy it and please tell me what is error in this code and then okay click here and then what is error this code and when you run it like that there are three basics so it uh, now responsive more accurate and analyzes it and again paste it again do it so now it has me start to giving me and when I paste it like that so now when you run it so now when you run it from here it is not running when I say it like here it is not running so it give me like that here you can see it brain.js now it has been run it like that here it is stalling the brain.js just wait and watch uh, it is it is downloading the brain.js okay so we are come let me explain more things uh, it is because it is stalling the node uh, brain.js that's why let me told you more thing else example explain a neural network is created with new brain dot neural network the network is trained with network dot train examples the examples represent four input values with a corresponding output value. With run 1,0, you ask what is likely output of 1,0. The answer from the network is 193% close to 1, 06% close to 0. How to predict the contrast? With CSS, colors can be shared by the RGB, like this are one colors like black, yellow, red, white, light gray, dark gray. It is all, all uh, color shared by the RGB. Like here you can see it. RGB 00, RGB 255, 0. Like here you can see it. The example below this demonstrate how to predict the dark darkness of the color. Okay. So this one code has been written. Let me explain this code. This is, okay. It has been downloaded the NPM dot install dot brain dot js when i copy it and when i go here when i make one file by the name of index dot html i am making this file under documents and when i make this file and when i write here doc type then html then head then body then script and then paste it okay when you paste it and now it has been coming like that here you can see it and when you go here and when you write here h1 like neural network save it and run it so here you can see it is coming like that so now uh, in the replit there are some issues that's why it is not uh, coming okay so let's come here now like there is one uh, some code are also here when i copy this code and when i paste this code save it it is giving you the error what type of error it is giving me save it and run it so here you can see neural network is coming like that and when i go here and write neural networks 
Okay, here you can see it is coming like that and it is running very successfully. Now, example explain. A neural network is created with new brain dot neural network. The network is trained with network dot train examples. The example represents four input values, a corresponding output value. With network dot run 0, 0, 128 slash 255, you ask what is the likely output of a dark blue. The answer from the network is dark 95% and the light should be 4%. Why not edit the example to test the likely output of the yellow or red? Okay, so here you can see it in today's video. I told you about what are brain.js in the in the machine learning, and I also run the code all, uh, also here. You can see like that. And if you giving if someone is giving you an error here, so you can space from here to give you the intent indentation errors. Uh, okay, so that's why you can space from here, and then uh, it will not give you the error. And when you copy this code. And when I copy this code and let me go here on my replet again and when I say create REPL, no, 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 not create REPL. Let me click on my I node.js file and when I create it, so when I, uh, it is taking a little bit loading like that and when it has been opened it, let me show you now when it has been copied which language code when i write like that why what is error in this code then it, uh, it now it is giving me like that why it's not giving me okay oh and when i enter press now when i copy it and when i go on my visual studio code file and when i paste this like here now here you can see it is not giving me the error like that here you can see it so like that you can do it very easily as yes. so and when i go here and when i make one style.css and then make one file so be color sorry color so be dark blue okay when i go here and when i link the file from here rel style sheet href save it and now here can, it is also coming in the dark blue why it is coming in the dark blue because here i write like dark ratio one that's why here you can see it like that you can do it very easily yes so here you can see it in today's video i tell you about what a brain.js on the machine learning so your hope i hope your concept will be clear about that water where brain.js in the machine learning if your concept will be clear about that so please tell me in the comment yeah my concept will be clear and please must you must know that like brain.js is a javascript library what brain.js is a javascript library uh, library that makes it easy to understand neural networks because it hides the complexity of the meta matrix okay so please like this video share your friends and subscribe to my channel do not forget to all the notification bell also so you never miss up my latest future videos so now i am your next class and next for your amazing class of django so for today goodbye